and welcome to Simply Pamela, where we want to help everyone be what? Simply fabulous. If this is your first time here, I like to say welcome, welcome. And to all my return subscribers, I like to say, hey girl, so glad you came back to see me. Alrighty, so yes, I have been missing for a while, but I am back and hopefully better than ever. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and get right into this video. Today I'm doing one piece three ways. So I'm going to show you how I take this black skirt and everybody, well, almost everybody should have a black skirt in their wardrobe. So any style black skirt will work, whether it's a pencil skirt, it's like a peplum or one with a ruffle like I have, no matter, or a slip skirt, whatever kind of black skirt you have, I'm just going to give you some ideas of what you can do with it. So first of all, I'm just starting off with this black skirt that I got from Torrid. It has pockets. I absolutely love this skirt. One of my most favorite skirts in my closet and probably one of the most warm ones in it as well. So love the skirt. And I always try to uh, get the most out of my wardrobe here. So this one, this time I have paired it with um, this golden mustardy color top that I got from Ross. I love the structure of this top. This is different for me. I like the silky kind of material. It kind of feels like silk. So I love that. I love the sleeves on it. The dolman-like sleeves. They're short, but I love these sleeves. And I love the neckline. So finding a top that has an interesting neckline, inter interesting kind of sleeves, uh, that adds interest to the outfit, to the look itself. So that's what I'm doing with this. I really like it. I like the high neckline too. I, for me, I really like that. And then I just accessorized. And so how I accessorize, let's go down to the shoes. And you've seen these shoes before. Love these shoes. Probably one of my one of my most favorite shoes in my closet. The Gianni Beanie shoes. So just a black shoe that has the, the gold studs all over them. So I'll show you the shoe from the black. From the black. From the back. <laughs> so like these. And then I just added my jewelry and I'm just using a uh, black and gold jewelry. This one came from a consignment shop. So I really like that. And then added my gold dome ring and then added my um, black and gold earrings. And the earring has, it's, it's like a velvet. So it has texture. That's something again, that adds interest to the outfit. And then even my belt is the black and gold. You've seen this one before, cause I get a lot of wear out of this belt. So the black and gold with that as well. So love it. And then I'm going to top it off with my purse. This is a Goodwill piece. So you know I'm always adding thrifty pieces to my looks. And it has the gold across the top. And then I'm going to finish it off with my big black shades. Absolutely love these. So, you know, especially now as we're starting to, uh, it won't be long before we'll be into the spring start. Thinking about your shades again, ones that you haven't worn, start looking through your shade uh, collection and picking out what you know you're going to wear. If they're ones you're like, you know, I don't even like these anymore. I'm probably not going to wear them. Go ahead and donate. Get rid of them. So I love these shades. So what do you think of look number one? This is the first way I am styling this black skirt. Alrighty, ladies, I will be back with the next look. Alrighty, ladies, so I am back with the next look. And this time I am giving you somewhat of a classic black and white look. Now, you know, most people have some kind of white top in their closet. And I say classic because black and white, it is classic. But I say somewhat because the top is so different. So I love the top. So finding a, a white top that's a little different from anything that you have in your wardrobe that you really like. So this one I really love because I love these sleeves. They're so big and billowy. I love that. That for me is something different. I like the fact that at the waistline, it has a knot right here. So I don't need to wear a belt with it because it just comes right down over that uh, waist, waistband on the skirt. So it works perfectly. I also love the fact that it is a V-neck. And I love the fact that it has a little snap right here. You know, that's always helpful, especially if you have a big bust. So anytime you're fine, you know, you find a white top that has a V-neck or even if it just has buttons all the way down. If you find one that has a snap, that will help you out so many, so many ways. So I really like that because you don't have to worry about that gaping. So I really like that. So love the white top, love the V-neck, love the billowy sleeves, love the waistline. All of these things you know, make it a little bit different. 
So think about that when you're looking for a white top. Of course, you can just wear your button down or whatever you already have. But if you want something new to pair with something older, think about that. Okay, so all I did was accessorize with gold and pearls. So let's start with the shoes. The shoe is a Jessica Simpson shoe. And it is a gold metallic slingback. Uh, it has a platform and it has a thick heel. I love that because I, I really realize that um, I do so much better with a thicker heel now. I still have some skinny ones, but I do a lot better with the thick ones. So like this, and the platform makes it easier to walk in. Like I said, no belts, but I have the gold and pearl jewelry. So I have the gold and pearl bangle bracelet. And then I have the gold and pearl Avon ring. And then I have the gold and pearl heart-shaped earrings. And then last of all, and I love, you know I'm loving brooches or loving pins now. I have this pin. It's gold with the pearl in the middle. Oh, I love it. And the bigger, the better. So look for brooches. A good place to look is at a consignment shop, at Goodwill, any kind of thrift stores. You can find uh, pins. This one happened to come from It's Fashion. Every now and then I can find big pins like this there, and that's where this one came from. So I didn't add a necklace because I felt like the pin for me was enough. I mean, you can pile it on, but the pin was enough for me. So I really like this. I'm gonna add, you know, another thrifted piece. And this is the, uh, my Agner gold purse. It has a little Agner right here. And everybody remembers Agner back in the day. You had an Agner purse, girl. You was the stuff back then. <laughs> and then I'm going to top it off with my gold and white shades. So, what do you think of this look? I really like how this turned out. Alrighty, ladies. I will be back with the next look. Alrighty, ladies, so I am back with the last look, and I absolutely love this look. I am wearing a thrifted, this one came from the Goodwill, striped top. It is 100% silk. Love it, love it, love it. What is uh, different about this top that I really like, and to be honest, I didn't even, I don't know if I realized it when I bought it. Maybe I did, but it, it requires cuff lengths, and it has, so you know I didn't have any cuff lengths. I had to borrow my husband's. So I just put his cuff length on it right there. And actually, uh, you can either put it in this hole or this hole, or I guess you could wear two if you wanted to. But I just that is just so different. You know, you don't see that often in a lady shirt. And this is a lady shirt. So I love that. So that's the kind of things I'm I'm talking to you about when you're looking for something that's different in a top. And a thrift store is a good place to find things that that are different. So love it. I love these colors in it. They just make me happy. <laughs> just the striped uh, colors in the shirt. Love it. It is a button down. It just has the collar. So other than that, I think just the fact that the colors, it makes it stand out and these cuffs make it stand out. So love these. And I actually like, like when a top is long like that. That kind of covers part of my hand. I, I don't know why, but I really like that. So that is the top. Then uh, I just added my plain black belt. So you've seen this before, it came from Goodwill. And then I added a shoe that I got. This one came from, um, you know, Burlington, I believe. So I like this one because it, it has a pop of color and that's what I was looking for for this outfit, just that pop of color. And it does just have a, a low heel. So the heel isn't high, but the heel is kind of curved. So it adds a little bit of interest. So really like it. And these are comfortable because they're not high or anything. So I said, I still do have some skinny heels. So that's one of the skinny ones and they are comfortable. And then I just added my jewelry and I tried to keep that color going on because look at the earrings. You've seen these before, but I haven't worn them in a long time. And I just thought they work perfectly with this top. So the black background and then it has the different color jewels on it. So really like that. I just added my blue ring to add some more color. No bracelet because I didn't need it with these sleeves, girl. And then I added my pin. And you see my pin. This came from a consignment shop. And you see it has all these colors in it. So it works perfectly with the top. 
See, girl, that's why you got to pick up your pieces at your little thrift stores, you know, and then you can coordinate your outfit. And I'm going to also add, you know, I couldn't have a video where I did not add a hat. So this is the hat I'm adding, and it has a little sparkly on the side. Let me get that lean right. So that is the hat. I am going to add my purse. And the purse has all these colors in it that I thought went well uh, with the top. And then the background is orange. And then I'm adding my green shade. So I'm doing color all the way, ladies. I'm taking it all the way up. So this is the look. This is the look. So nice and colorful. Wear this, even though it's, it's, you know, if it's still cold where you are, just add a jacket. And this is it. So see how interesting this is with this colorful top? Love it. What do you think of this final look? Well, ladies, I really hope you enjoyed this video today. I really enjoyed making it for you. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe. And if you really like the video, make sure you share it because we're really trying to grow the Simply Pamela family. Until next time, bye.